again. Welcome to Math Angel 369. This is Angela Morgan Green and today we are going to be talking about how to factor numbers. Now when we're factoring numbers, we use two numbers that we can multiply together to give you the number that we are trying to factor. Keep in mind that you only use positive whole numbers and negative whole numbers. Another way to put that, you will use the integers except the number zero. For example, two factors into a positive one and a positive two. It also factors into a negative one and a negative two because negative one times a negative two gives you a positive two. However, in our examples, we will only use the positive whole numbers. Let's get right into an example. Let's say that I give you the number eight. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a factor T chart. And now I'm just going to go ahead and just write all the numbers one through eight. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now I'm going to ask myself, what are two numbers that I can multiply by that will give me the number eight? So let's look at our first number. Well, one times eight is eight, so I'm going to go ahead and write the number eight. What about the number two? Well, two times four is eight, right? So I'm gonna write the number four beside the two. What about the number three? Well, there's no other whole positive number that I can multiply three by to give me the number eight. So I'm gonna go ahead and erase the number three. What about the number four? Well, we begin to see a repeat. So we have the number four, but we also have the number four here. And we already said that two times four is eight. So once you begin to see a repeat, Everything that comes after it is really unnecessary. But just for the sake of observation, let us sort of look through all the numbers. Well, yes, we said four works, right? What about five? Five does not work because there's no other number I can multiply five by that will give me the number eight. So I'm going to erase the five. What about the number six? No. Six doesn't work either, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and erase the six. What about the seven? Nope, seven doesn't work. So I'm gonna erase the seven. What about the number eight? Yes, we said eight works. We said eight times one is eight, right? So we see that four and eight only repeats itself. So the only things we need to be concerned with are one, two, four, and eight. So our factors are one, two, four, and eight. Not so bad, right? So let's try another example. Okay, so how about I give you the number 12? Again, I'm going to write a factor T chart. And again, I want to go ahead and write all of the whole numbers between one and 12. So let us observe each number. 1 times what is 12? Well, 1 times 12 is 12. So I'm going to write the number 12. How about the number 2? Well, 2 times 6 is 12, so that works. What about the number 3? Well, 3 times 4 is 12. Oh, well, we see a repeat. 
we have the number four here, but we have already uh, we all we have already written the number four, right? So I am going to say that this is really all I need, right? So let's verify. Well, we said that four times three is twelve. Five doesn't work, so I'm just going to go ahead and erase. What about the number six? Yes, six and two works. What about the number seven? No. What about the number eight? No, it doesn't work. The nine doesn't work. The 10 doesn't work. The 11 doesn't work. But yes, the 12 works because we have a repeat. So our factors are one, two, three, four, six, and 12. How did you like that? Would you like to see another example? Okay, one more time and then you will try. Okay, how about the number 24? Let's do it the fast way this time. Okay, obviously one in 24 works. The number two and the number 12 work. How about the number three? Yes, three times eight is 24, right? Let's write that down. What about the number four? Yes, four times six is 24. What about seven? No, seven doesn't work. What about eight? Yes, we've already said eight works with three. Therefore, we already have a repeat, we can stop. So our factors, are one, two, three, four, eight, twelve, and twenty-four. How great was that? All right, your turn. Okay, so I'm going to give you the number thirty-six. Can you tell me what the first factor will be? It'll be one and what? You said it correctly. Yes, 36. What about the number two? Oh, you guys are so amazing. Yes, two and 18 is 36. How about the number three? Yes, you said it. Three and 12 is 36. So how about the number four? What was that? Yes, four and nine is 36. How about five? You're right, five does not work. How about six? Great, you guys are so awesome. Six and six works. How about seven? No, seven doesn't work. How about eight? No, eight doesn't work. What about nine? Well, hmm. We have a repeat. Yes, nine is already on the board. We can stop. So our factors, thank you for helping me find my factors. Yes, we have one, two, three, four, six, nine, 12, 18, and 36. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.